Bill Lambier. What are you thinking, man? Seriously. Like, I'm going to be honest. I don't like you. I enjoy hearing stories about you. I enjoy watching old tape of you. But I can't stand players like you. I just don't. You're just a big bully. I don't know. I just don't like you. I just don't like the way you play. You coaching in the WNBA today. That's cool. Whatever, man. I just, I just don't care. But what you said and what I heard today is driving me nuts. It's driving me crazy. If you didn't hear anything about this, let me set this up for you. Let me set this up. Our man Bill Lambeer said that if he was putting a basketball team around a player, he would want LeBron on his team and not Michael Jordan. Okay, if this was anybody else, I would say, all right, yeah, LeBron, that's cool because he has a skill set that's on match, he can pass the ball, he can rebound, he can score, blah, 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 blah. He's a champion, I get it. I get it. Go LeBron. That's awesome. But I would never take LeBron over Michael Jordan when I was starting a team. You cannot, no matter what, pass up on six NBA championships out of six tries. Man, you win every championship, every finals you've ever been in, you've beat. Now, I know why he was doing this. The Pistons, the bad boys, as a lot of people remember them by, the Pistons used to battle with the Bulls all the time in the playoffs. The Bulls lost to him a few times, and the Bulls beat him a few times. That's just what happened. And Bill Lambeer was one of their, like, go-to, you know, strong guys. Don't mess with me. We're tough. Sort of crap. Whatever. But, man, like, I know you don't like Michael Jordan, but, dude, you still have to be jabbing on him all these years later. He's the greatest of all time. More than likely, he'll be the greatest of all time. Because it's going to be very hard for somebody to step in the league and win six out of six championships, or even seven out of seven championships to beat you. That's gonna be tough. That's Michael Jordan, man. That's the greatest of all time, the GOAT. He should be the logo. Jerry West, don't get me wrong, you're a good player, man. You're one of the best of all time, but man, Michael Jordan should be the logo. At least he's good enough to have been, at least consider being a logo. It's Michael Jordan, man. How'd he pass up? Like I mentioned before, 10 minutes down the road right there is Laney High School. Right where Michael Jordan went to high school. The, the infamous where Jordan got cut from school, from his basketball team, happened right down the road, man. It's like so, I'm so into Michael Jordan down here. Everybody's into Michael Jordan. So I'm on that bandwagon. I'm on it. I mentioned before, I used to watch Michael Jordan play, and it was awesome. How can you go against that Bill Lee and Beer? What are you thinking, man? Like, I get it. You're a big bully. You're all tough still, whatever. Like, come on, man. Be honest with yourself. If you want to be honest with us, be honest with yourself behind closed doors. You know you would pick Michael Jordan over LeBron James. It'd be a good pick either way. You can't go wrong either way. Because both guys can facilitate whatever. With that being said, Michael Jordan, how can you go wrong? So Billy and Beer, you're driving me nuts over here. But I'd like to hear what you think about it. I'd like to hear what my subscribers think about it, what my guests on this page and on this video think about it. Tell me in the comments below because I'm genuinely curious about this. Who would you pick? Start a team with LeBron or Michael Jordan? No arguing with people, none of that trolling stuff. I just want to genuinely hear who would you start the team with and why? Let me know. And again, thank you for all my followers. Thank you for all paying attention. Just giving me the time of day. It makes me feel good and I want to keep making videos for y'all. Have a good day. We'll catch you next video. Bye-bye.